Hi everybody. Now I want to continue the uh, radiant energy receiver test. Um, as usual, I have a Slayer Exciter with primary and secondary coils, and um, the secondary coil has a top load and here I have a, the uh, receiver connected to a 230 volt light bulb and directly to the earth ground. This time the uh, um, receiver looks like this. Here I have two receivers. Um, they are um, uh, copper pipes. This one is the uh, eight millimeter um, pipe, and the other one is a uh, fifteen millimeter copper pipe and as usual these are my light bulbs this is the uh, test light bulb connected to the ground and this is the reference light bulb um, I will uh, connect it to 230 volt AC and the other side of the uh, cable of the light bulb will be connected to the uh, radiant energy receiver ok and here is my uh, um, Slayer Exciter circuit. This is the uh, primary coils, and this is the uh, secondary coil, and this is the uh, top load, and this is my. Uh, um, uh, power supply ok um, now let's test this one um, the uh, 8 millimeter copper coil goes all the way down like this let's put it here inside I'll connect this cable here okay now we'll turn on the uh, reference um, light bulb okay now turn on the uh, power supply okay I can only power it with uh, 20 volt and 4.8 amps but I cannot get the uh, the same brightness as the uh, um, reference uh, light bulb so let's turn it off and let's try the other one
and this one is uh, shorter so it goes to the uh, about the half of the uh, secondary coil okay I'll connect the, uh, the load okay. With this receiver I can power the uh, Slayer Exciter until 20.4 volt and with the current of uh, 4.05 amps but as you can see um, I cannot get the same brightness as the uh, reference uh, light bulb so I think uh, my previous test with the uh, um, other um, receiver uh, was better than this one. Okay, that's it for now. Um, See you next time. Bye-bye.